Good morning, guys. It's really different. So we're in Zach's truck today. He went to get. <laughs> he went to get new tires put on my car and get it inspected. Guys, I'm falling over. You're falling over. Why are you falling over? Because it's so weird. <laughs> You're crazy. The girls are off to go on their field trip. Yeah. Yay! So I'm gonna go run them over. And we're going to Sky Zone. Yes. You're gonna go jump. Yeah. Nice. Okay, and we're off. Just dropped off the girls. Um, they're going to have an amazing day. They get to go to Sky Zone, which is a trampoline park. Um, this is their last field trip of the summer. We'll be gone next week. They do like a, next week's the last week of rec program. Um, there's a truck in front of me that's got a bunch of trees on it, and they're dropping big branches. Lovely. Anyways, good thing I'm in the truck. <laughs> Um, so, yeah, they've really enjoyed that program all summer. Um, it's a great program. Uh, next week they'll be able to go a couple days if they choose to, um, but they'll miss out on the last party. They do, like, a big, huge, like, um, slip and slide on the last day, um, but we'll be gone then, so they'll miss out on that, but it's okay. Um, they've really enjoyed it, and... It's great because they get to go and hang out with their friends for a little while, and yeah. So anyways, and they've gone on some really amazing field trips, so that's great. Oh my goodness, one big branch is going to fall. <laughs> Sorry. Um, so yeah. yeah, but I'm headed home. Zach, like I said, went down and got new tires put on the car and got it inspected, so that's all ready to go. Um, that was due this month, so and we'll be gone, so um, we went ahead and got that done, so that will be all set. Um, yeah, um, and tonight we're having a date night. We're gonna be celebrating our 14th anniversary of um, wedding, our wedding, so that's pretty exciting. The day that our anniversary was on was on the 6th, and um, it was during the week and it was just too hard. Zach had like meetings and stuff that he had to do. So um, we couldn't celebrate on that day. But we're going to be celebrating tonight. We're going to be going to a Mexican restaurant. Um, we've never tried this Mexican restaurant, but um, it has really good reviews online and we're excited. We love Mexican. Um, so yeah, and we'll be going with my cousin and her husband. Um, they're celebrating their 19th anniversary so it's kind of cool to be able to do that um, so yeah I can't believe that it's been 14 years like it goes by so fast um, it's just crazy but I love the life that we have built together so it's great to be able to celebrate that and yeah so anyways I'm heading home Okay, so Zach was out early this morning to go get um, new tires put on my car, and because he's the best husband ever, he went to TJ Maxx when they opened. I haven't been to a store opening in quite a while. I just haven't been able to do it with the kids and stuff being off from school. So he went in, and he was the third person in the store. There was one other lady there that was there for Ray Dunn. He didn't get any, um, like, shopping um, in the store video, but um, he did pick me up a Halloween item. He said there really wasn't a bunch of stuff there. There was a trick or treat, um, the silverware holders. The other lady got that first. Um, but there was these, and I'm super excited about them. Trick, treat. Um, they're the pet bowls, but I don't think I'm going to use them as pet bowls. Um, unless I get a bunch of, you know, radon stuff. <laughs> Maybe I'll use them for pet bowls. But I was thinking these would be really cute if you have, like, a party or something. Um, you could put dip in them. 
Um, so yeah, I think that that will probably be what I use them for is, um, they're so cute. And I love the black and orange. Um, but yeah, they're a good size bowl. You could even like, um, make like a little like pot pie in them. Um, they're dishwasher safe and uh, microwave safe. So yeah, I think they're oven safe, I'm assuming. Um, it doesn't say they are, but I would assume they're probably just like any of the other dishes. Um, but yeah, I really like them. They're super cute. Even if I just like stacked them and displayed them, I think that's super cute. Um, so yeah, I'm so happy that he found them. Um, there was no Halloween mugs there, big shocker. But you know what? I know eventually I'll run into them. I know I like was obsessed with getting the Easter mugs and then eventually I just found the ones that I really wanted. So I know if I'm just patient and that I wait, I definitely probably will run into something that I want. Um, so yeah, and that's the fun of the game is hunting for the items. But I was so happy that he picked these up for me. Um, I thought it was super sweet of him. And I'm so happy to have them for my collection. So this is my first piece of Halloween for this year. Um, I wasn't collecting last year when Halloween hit. So it's crazy to think that August is when Halloween hits. <laughs> like seriously, that's crazy. But um, I'm super excited for fall time and to decorate for Halloween and Thanksgiving. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you next time. Okay, so it's that time of day. I'm gonna go get the girls from their field trip. I can't wait to see um, or hear how their day was, and that's where I'm off to. Okay, so I just picked up the girls. Did you guys have so much guys, fun? Guys, guess what? Somebody give me this sleep mask. Oh, really? Yeah. That's crazy. So did you guys have fun? Yeah. And you guys got snacks? What did you get for a snack? I got a slushy and Charlie got Skittles. And Sam shared her slushy with, with my friends. Right? That's cool. Nice. I'm glad you guys had so much fun. Guys, did you know I was waiting for somebody to give me a, a sleep mask? <laughs> You're so funny. Oh my goodness. Okay, so we're heading home to have some lunch. Yep. Okay, so I'm making a few snacks for later after dinner. We're going to play cards. So I'm making buffalo chicken dip. So I put a half a cup of hot sauce, a half a cup of ranch dressing, one brick of cream cheese, a half a cup of um, cheddar. I actually didn't have cheddar on hand, so I just used the Mexican blend cheese. And then I took two of those chicken patties, the vegan ones. Now this is where I would um, take a can of chicken or a chicken like breast that you've cooked. I'm going to chop up the chicken patties and throw it in. And then you just pretty much um, melt it all down into a dip and then you're good to go. Okay, so I chopped up the two chicken patties. Um, this is a vegan chicken patty. Um, you want to make sure that you do this on low because um, you do not want it to burn. So, and then I'm going to add the chicken to it. For like a little dessert after dinner. Um, we might get dessert, but at least the kids will have these. But we're going to play games, so we'll probably want snacks for later. Um, so I got this chocolate chip cookie brownie bar mix. And on the back you can make cookie brownie cupcakes. So that is what I'm going to do. Okay, so the girls are going to be hanging out with Maisie. Have fun. You having a pizza party? <laughs> okay, guys. So we um, are here at our house, and we are play like, Maisie's watching us, our cousin. And we got pizza, as you can see. Look at the pizza. It looks so yummy. Hey. Hey. Buddy, are we going to have Mexican? Are we going to have Mexican? We got Ella and Jeremy and Angela and Zach, of course. Have some Mexican food. Oh, I 
Dutch, right? Wings? Oh, it's just like Sam. He wants more. He likes it. <laughs> He's, he's still making a face, but he he's just like keeps going for more. He's like spicy and anything like sour. sour. Oh my! <laughs> he's like tapping out. <laughs> 